<laughs> what is up, YouTube land? And we have Game Boy Theater again, bringing you the best of uh, Clax. Remember Clax? It that, really was everywhere. It's that game that had a hand on it. Please select a level. One, six, eleven. All right. How about one? Complete three claxes to advance to the next wave. A clax is three tiles of the same pattern in a row. Oh, oh my sweet god. Holy crap. I mean, this is definitely clax. All right, so I catch it. And what is going on? <laughs> I'm too small brain for this game. So this is not... I, I think they're usually supposed to be, like, different oh, colors. Okay, and this is brutal. You like the music? It's great. There's no pause. Select is pause. What a game. <laughs> yep. I don't even know what to say. I know that's not right, but whatever. Yeah, there's not enough... I think that's the point, otherwise it'd be way too easy. Yep. Wow. I got a clax. We, we got a clax. What a hit. Nope. Oh, it doesn't it doesn't stay on the, the top if you don't specifically drop it yourself. That's kinda lame. Oh boy. Gotta make a clax. Um was there like different like difficulty options? They're starting on a different level. Okay, yeah. <laughs> uh, price for this right, one? Right. Luckily, the second game is much more interesting. Eight dollars. Uh, ten. Here we go. Here's the third clax. We did it! Wow. There's not even noises when you when you do that. Clax. Oh, there's a Game Boy Color version. I've seen that before. Well, let me do level 11 just to get BTFO'd. This, this might be... Make a big Oh, man. X There's also a Game Boy Advance version that comes with Marble Madness, so finding the actual just regular Game Boy one is kind of annoying. Can we agree that... So I can hold up to five. Did you see that, Trev? I can hold up to five, which makes things, I guess, better. Oh, that's cool. Uh... All right, let's be. This let's, game might actually be like fifteen bucks. Let's be serious here. Is this the most bare bones game we've seen on Game Boy Theater? I mean, there's not even music. Like, there's literally no music. I want to say that it's there's not even a pause menu. It's close, but the thing is that I think the main gameplay itself was fairly um, high effort in terms of I don't know, just the way it looks and the graphics. Let's see what happens when we lose. Oh, okay. Uh, what if I just do that? Great. Even this is too slow. I just can't believe that this game was popular enough to be re-released on the NES, the Game Boy, the Game Boy Color, and then eventually the Game Boy Advance. It's like, who who cares about Clax? Oh, I don't even lose from that. Oh, the drop. Uh, okay. All right, next game. <laughs> I just want to see the lose screen. That's all. Okay. Because the next game, being a shooter, has the possibility of me like dying in two minutes. All right, what happens? Bump, ba da da, bump, bump, bump. That is, that's bare bones. Yeah, that is very. Uh, like that is like, whoo boy. Like at least some of the other bad uh, puzzle games we saw, and not to say that Clax is a bad puzzle game. Like it actually seems like it's like fairly deep. But at least they had music, dude. Uh, did you know that Ultra Games was actually Konami? Say what? They had to go under a different name because Nintendo had a really weird rule that publishers can't make more than a certain amount of games per year. Did you know that? Only I know that. All right, I like this game. Auto what? Shop. You get fifty-six continues? Bro, I could be ninety-nine. <laughs> It, okay. want, it wanted you to stop on the, the funny number, and once you went one what over... What just happened? <laughs> the cartridge literally just exploded. The cartridge was like, excuse me! S S what I, I keep I keep forgetting to like just constantly clean all these games before we start playing, but that's that's some of the that's some of the enjoyment. Let's just do something I would actually use. Auto shot on or off? I wanna say on. Now let's go. Oh boy. Uh, this is definitely Gradius. Gradius and 5 FPS. 
I mean, at least it has music, and uh, it has a, a background that scrolls in a different rate than the foreground. So you know what auto shot it looks pretty good. You know what auto shot means? It means you hold it in and it shoots. Like, could you imagine like not choosing that? That like every time you have to just be like, eh. <laughs> it's like server Silver Surfer. It doesn't even have the option for that. See how fast we can go. I'm going a little bit too fast. This processing is a little bit too blast. So yeah, I like Gradius. I like Gradius 1. Yeah. I like Gradius 3. Uh, I've never played another Gradius game. I played Gradius... I think there was a Gradius collection on PSP. That's how I played 4. And I remember liking that game too. But it's like, how do you mess it up? It's like, the games are cool. Event... <laughs> no! Bruh! We'll give it one more try. Oops, sorry. We'll give it one more try. I just like how every Gradius game eventually has a, uh, what do you call them, Moe heads? Yes, yes, the they Easter Island. Yeah, they always have those for some reason. Um, well, let's, let's just see what, uh... Uh, guess some price? Oh, goodness, I'll Nemesis. Say 20 bucks. Uh, I'll say 25 Stage 5, level 1? Well, no, let's do stage 5, level... Oh my gosh, am I, like, at the boss gauntlet? I mean, it's pretty cool you can just start here. Oh, that's cool. So you can just skip ahead. That wasn't paying attention. Yeah, I'm on stage 5, level 2, whatever that uh... means. Ah! Rest 10. Not good enough. Actually, not as expensive as I expected. $15 generally. There is kind of a, a janky copy that has, like, a chipped, like, front, like, right where the contacts are for less than 10 bucks, but that doesn't really count. $15. Slightly surprising. Like Trev said. But, uh, I guess, I don't know. I guess Konami at the time was really mass-producing their games, because you can find Life Force and Gradius on NES for, like, 15 20 bucks easily. Maybe this was a bad idea. At least I get to choose whatever level I want at any time. Where did the sound effects go for a little bit? There's too many sprites on screen. I'm, I'm, so I, my very first reaction was yikes. But I take that back and say, like, for Game Boy, this is running pretty well. Yeah, I, I wish it ran a little tiny bit better, like just a couple FPS better. But it's it's very uh, impressive. Do you, do you know what it runs better than? The freaking Super Nintendo version. Dude, go away. Yeah, the Super Nintendo one's weird because uh, it doesn't want to skip frames. So, like, when you have all that slowdown... It's because it wants to render every single frame individually, even though the Super Nintendo CPU can't do it. Especially just the king. You know, Big Knight was here, he could do this in one life. <laughs> It'll never end! I don't want laser, I want option. 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 This is, uh, I know this is the last level, but this is, like, ah, pretty tough. If this starts me at the beginning. Oh, no, cool. Yeah, this game is surprisingly, um... Like, like, lenient? Yeah, it, like, lets you start any stage with it, any amount of lives. Yeah. Uh, this is definitely, I, I want to say, if you're into games like this at all, this is definitely a must-buy on yeah, the, Yeah, I, uh, I kind of wish we had this as kids now. I think there's no doubt it's a, it's a must-buy, especially considering, I don't remember what episode this is at Game Boy Theater, but this is definitely, like, top 10% of games we played, and I think that's, uh not even in question. It works. Wait, did I choose this hole again? God dang it. Well, I won't go too long on this. I'll, uh, let me give it one or two more tries. I mean, I assume the bosses will be the same that they always are. No, 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 no. Bullet hell, baby. Dang it. These shooting mobs always suffer from the same curse. And it's that when you are doing good and you have all the power-ups, the game is awesome. But then you die one time, you're on a hard stage, you have nothing, and you're just like, I'm, I'm done playing this game. <laughs> okay, I want to double. I don't know what that was. Can things just stop appearing? What is this? When well, now the ship's sending itself at me? Bruh. Ah, uh, hi. No, 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 Okay. Go away. 
Uh, hi. Yeah, what the heck? I understand it's the last level, but holy crap, this stage. Uh, they really time these uh, moving Ah, oh, dang it! To the last possible second. Ah, oh, this is the same play. Alright, so that, that's it. I'm not going to go through that again. But yeah, uh, this would be a fun one to actually play. And the fact that you can just give yourself as many lives as you want and start on any level, that's really forgiving for a Game Boy game. So let's uh, not give our seal of approval to Clax, but give our seal of approval to uh, Nemesis. So once again... Well, actually, I, I don't want to say once again we had one good, one bad game because we almost always have two bad games. <laughs> <laughs> All right, see you next time.